What is up DTube Steam blockchain? So today I want to talk a little bit about that emotional intelligence is higher intelligence than logic or intellect. It's a higher dimension of intelligence. And because emotions, it's more juicy. It's, first of all, yeah, it's a, it's a juicier version of logic and intellect in many ways. It is, it, it has the potential to look at things with more context and with more nuanced perspectives. So, people that have a high emotional intelligence, they will sort of be in demand for 2030 and coming up because because there's a lot of people that basically don't know really how to be happy um, and uh, they don't maybe not even be aware that it's like they may not be aware of their like their state and like how how they can like char take charge over like let's say their own emotional state and it's like there's a lot of people that do not know how to do that so I emotional intelligence like in the past people looked at emotions as some kind of weakness or something that was like negative or bad like because in many ways people did not really understand it and and in a more scarce society also uh, logic and intellect it becomes of course and book knowledge obviously becomes more important right but when you have like more let's say free time over then emotional intelligence really comes into its full power so it's kind of interesting how it works like me for example if I look at the I have feelings introverted uh, which is a function uh, in the Myers-Briggs personality test FI and it basically means like I can look at stuff and then I sort of feel those feelings that that object or that human sort of felt like I experienced that feeling inside of myself and like create my own sort of experience of how it must be for them and it's it's very interesting because you get extremely different um, like you can feel other people's emotions and feeling states quite fast and uh, and it's very interesting because every person has so different they, they come with like very different unique unique things and you can sort of feel it with feelings that like the emotional state that different, different people come from like how different it is how nuanced it is and uh, and when you really start to dive deeper into this you you see that the intellect it can it's always going to be sharper but it, it cannot like embrace life like emotions it can basically embrace life like it can, it can understand like let's say the fullness of life which is something that the intellect or the logical mind it will never understand uh, if it see a tree uh, we have a tree here let's see like this is a tree over here now if you show this tree to a person that is just overly concerned with logic and intellect they're not even gonna see the tree here you know what they're gonna see they're gonna see a wood they're gonna call this tree a wood they basically want to chop it down okay they don't want to embrace it they don't want to know this one because they're like what's the, what's the point of the tree like what is the point of this tree here like there must be a usability aspect like how can we use this tree like we have to use everything in the existence to gain more profit right so it's like we should cut down this tree we should cut it down today Let's cut it down. It has no use. It has no value just standing here. Like, what is the point of this tree? What is this tree doing in this forest? You're standing here. Like, it's such a waste. We can cut it down. We can make a profit. And it's going to be amazing. That's like how logic and intellect look at, looks at everything in the existence. It cannot hug the tree. It cannot know the tree. 
it cannot understand how the tree is being connected to your existence and how you are sort of breathing the same air like when you're breathing he probably absorbs it like how can he become this big like this is huge right like that's a huge tree and it, it's like so emotional intelligence is like 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 for intellect like if an intellect person looked looked at that like right there or the logic person looked at that right there they would say that's that's, that's so stupid that's really stupid you did not make you did not make any point like what's the point of this adrian what is the point like they always want to get to the point or always want to look at everything as like how can we use 100 percent everything in the existence to make everything about the humans and not care about nature about the planet or anything else because all that matters is I get more ones and zeros. So yeah, I mean, that is, uh, that's like cool. That's something that, and I mean, emotional intelligence is, fu is, is, is fun that they're finally going to get their space. They're finally going to get their time to like shine in the world, which is great. Because then it's very rare that they've had that opportunity in the past. Uh, you need like an abundant society and then people are, are more open-minded to sort of absorb things, take things in, consider more things, right? So, so what I think that emotional intelligent people are going to do is they're going to be able to create interesting spaces and like if they like really change who they are, they're really going to change, let's say, the environment which they are in and that is that is going to be the most fascinating thing about about this whole thing right to like see how they can do cool things like make cool things happen and also how emotionally intelligent people they're not going to look at everything as a problem like many emotional intelligent people they can see like everything's good now like we don't have to change anything it's just good the way it is everything's good like stuff is good right so they, they have like an easier time to like appreciate stuff and not try to like find a point with every single thing or like find a meaning with every single thing like if you really look at this existence is basically too great to have a meaning like it, it like if you really look at it if you really perce if you really perceive it it's perfect right it, it is perfect like if someone genuinely looks at existence, everything is like in order, right? If you look in this, if you look in this forest, like everything is in order. Now in human societies, stuff is not in order. Like humans have to put stuff in its proper place. Like there's a lot of stuff that can be put into the proper place. And this brings me a little bit to life involvement. I, I wanted to have that in the title also because. Uh, emotional intelligent people, they will, they will also deeper understand concepts like life involvement. Like that life is basically about being involved in it. <laughs> that it's not like it's, it's, it's about the experience. Like it's about the experience and how deeply involved you can be in life right now. And you know, just enjoy it. And it takes, takes a bit from a person to really perceive stuff because the logic the logic aspect that's good that's we need for survival but it's like now when survival is taken care of it's like now it's just about the perceived function the perceived function is key now uh so person has to observe like and and it's like if you try to dive deeper into use logic and intellect you, you know you can you can you can be lost forever because the mind is a room with a million rooms. But emotional intelligent people, they understand that their emotions, is there's a beautiful experience with that. Like, something that you can't even explain in text. Something that you can't explain. But you can feel it, you can experience it, and it's awesome. It's just awesome, right? And, uh, and yeah. So that's what I wanted to talk a little bit about today. Um, it's a fun topic. It's fun. It's very fun. And uh, 
and emotionally intelligent people they are gonna have it easier to bring people into a state of where they can more explore the human being side because a lot of it is basically just about I think getting over some emotions that people hasn't got over and then when they've got over those emotions when they realize they can sort of self create emotions then it becomes kind of cool because then they are open to explore stuff right so yeah quick video talking about that have a great day dtube and the steam blockchain bye bye